Hey guys, it's MC. It's been a while. I hope everyone is safe. So I'm going to teach you how to flash China ROM or Global ROM on your G5 Pro GT or G6 Pro. So please read the video description. You need to download four files. So the first one is QFill. This is this software that we will use to flash the firmware to our phone. And the second one is Lenovo driver. And the third one is Q loader. So pick one here. If you are using a 32 bit PC, use this link. If you are using a 64 bit PC, use this link. So if you don't know what bit your Windows is running, so just type in the search box DXDIAG. Enter. And as you can see, Windows operating system, Windows 10 64 bit. So I'm I'm using this link. So if you are using a 32 bit PC, for example, Windows 7 32 bit. So download this one. And the third one is the RAR extractor or the zip file extractor. We will use this to extract the firmware. So if you are using 32 bit use this link if you are using a 64 bit use this link so install all of that just hit next everything just hit next 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 until it installs and after that reboot your pc so if you are flashing this on an internet cafe that has a diff twist just skip this part so if not, if you are using your own PC or your own laptop, just restart just your phone to make sure this will work. And the fourth one is the firmware. This will have will have at least three to four gigs. As you can see, this is three gigs. This is the firmware. This one is two point four. So what's the difference between the firmware, this is for L780051, this is for G6 Pro. So, if you want to flash the global ROM, just this one, this is the latest, 11.0405. If you want the China ROM, this is the latest one, 11.1.105. So after downloading the firmware, just extract the file. I'm just gonna show you guys a quick example. So we just go to, so for example, this is the firmware. So just copy this and go to local disk C. Make sure to paste this on local disk C. So I'll create a folder here. Rename it to whatever you want and paste the firmware and extract the firmware so this is the firmware okay remember that I'm just showing this on my example so extract here so after extracting that you will see something like this after it's done extracting so now we can move on to QFill so just type here QFill and enter if that doesn't show up just go to where did you install the q fill so for me it's here i'm just gonna close my q fill so double click it or run as administrator <coughs> Now let's set up the Q fill. So first configuration choose UFS EMMC is for G5S and G6 Lite. So for G5 Pro GT and G6 Pro we use UFS Sahara. So check reset after download. Make sure to not check this one. Erase all before download because if you check this one you will break your phone you can fix it but it's a pain of the 
ping in the ASP fix. So make sure to not turn this on and just press OK. Select Meta Build and select Browse. So now we're going to go to the firmware that we extract. So for me, it's here. And select DDR.L. And go to Load Content. So go to the folder that you extract the firmware again. And select Content. Open. Now turn off your phone. Just gonna turn off my phone now. Now my phone is off. Hold the volume up and volume down while your phone is still turned off. Just hold it. Don't release any keys. Just hold the volume up and volume down. And plug the USB to your PC and to your phone while holding the volume up and volume down. You will f your phone will vibrate and QFib will show something like this Qualcomm HS USB Q loader. Now you can remove holding the volume up and volume down. So now we can just click download content. And as soon as you see this one, you are now ready to go and wait for your phone to finish flashing. So I'm gonna pause this video for now to save some time. After 2 to 3 minutes, it's halfway there. So let's just wait. And after 6 minutes, I think, or 5 minutes, it's done flashing. So my phone now is booting. So after that, you just need to set up your phone, check everything, if everything works, and you are now done. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please press that like button. And... If you have a Z6 Pro phone or Z5S or Z5 Pro GT phone, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'll upload everything for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.